In this tutorial, let's see how to enter a purchase order. So there are two situations. One, you can enter a purchase order directly into Moyo, or you can use a quote. So in the previous example, we've seen how to enter a quote. So in this example, I'm going to use this quote and then create a purchase order. Okay. So let me bring up the quote first. So I go to purchase register. I select the supplier, which is Coles. So I have three I go to quotes and I have two quotes sitting here. Now I want to select the top one. So I click that white arrow. I'll go slow. So I'll click that white arrow. Right. And then this is my quote. So if I want to convert this to a purchase order, all I have to do is you see the order and bill. You just go to order and just click order. That's it. This has become a purchase order now. Okay, that's the purchase order. Now this would be the purchase order number, something like PO01. Right? And that would be my purchase order. And I'm recording this. Okay. If you notice now, go to purchase register. Go to all suppliers, click supplier and say codes. Go to quotes. You would still see two quotes there and you would see one purchase order appearing. So what it means is you can use these quotes for however number of times you want to create purchase orders. Okay. So this is the way you create a purchase order using an existing quote. Now let's see to create a purchase order without a quote. So for that, you need to go to enter purchases and select order. All right, and say code. All right. So here, I want to say 200 pens. I want to buy 200 pens, and this is office supplies, which I know. But let me double check. Yeah, and I want 200 dollars. My total balance is $200, $200, I have got this tick, I would say record. Okay, this is how you would enter a purchase order directly without using a quote. Now if you want to double check, you go to purchase register, go to all suppliers, click the supplier name you want, and go to orders, see, you see two orders. One is the one we used using a quote, one is the one we used and we, we've entered directly. Okay, so that's how you would enter a purchase order.